my best memories, I think the, the first one being, you know, the first year I started in 2015, um, we were able to make it all the way to the, the semifinals. And I think, I just think about how far that team came from the beginning of the season. Um, you know, I think we, we, we lost our first game and then um, we almost, we were losing our second game to Hampton at halftime. We almost went 0-2 to start that season and just to see, you know, how far I grew as a, as a player and as a quarterback, you know, I, I felt like a deer in the headlights the first couple games. And then, you know, being able to come into my own and, and kind of learn the position and, and um, you know, and then with the help of, of some great, great teammates, you know, we had a great offensive line and uh, a lot of a lot of good leadership on that team. That, that That's just that whole run, that whole journey I'll, I'll cherish forever. And then, um, you know, beating teams like, uh, even in that season, I, I would remember the JMU game on college game day. Um, you know, that's one that me and my buddies still talk about. And, and then uh, another one that sticks out was beating UVA in 2000, 2017. So, um, you know, those, those are some of them. We had some great teams and some, and, and some, great, uh, some great runs. But, um, you know, I, st I still talk to a lot of my Richmond teammates. And, uh, you know, I miss those days for sure. It's fun seeing guys, you know, like Dejan Brissett this year get drafted and mm -hmm. into the CFL and guys like Cortrell, you know, he, he's finding himself on a CFL team. But a lot of guys that I've worked with, even Brian, you know, he had a, he had a great career himself. Um, but, you know, I've had some great teammates, some great offensive lines. Um, but it, it's – it's uh, I ch definitely cherish my years with Spider football and, and uh, you know, don't take them for granted. Those were a lot, a lot of great memories that, that uh, we made there.